Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So a couple of months ago, I did a video where I told you my favorite kitchen items from Dollar Tree. I got a ton of response. You guys gave me some great suggestions for things to try. Plus, of course, I had more kitchen items that I like. So this is a whole new video where I'm sharing some more of my favorite kitchen items from Dollar Tree and ones that you guys suggested as well. So I mentioned this scraper in the last video and someone had a really great idea. They said that they like to use this for putting their glue gun on and I thought that is a great idea. Not only would this be great for a glue gun, but it would also be great for your curling iron upstairs, like so many options for like heated tools, you can just lay it on there. So I really like this. I said in the last video, I really like it for just scraping anything and I use this in my craft room more than anything. So talking about glue gun rest, that made me think of another product that I really love from Dollar Tree, and that is their coasters. They have a huge variety of coasters now. I thought this little grateful one was really cute. So I have used this for years underneath my glue gun. I mean, it gets all gunked up, but it's better than having it on your table. These are also great just to put by your bedside. I have one that I put by my bedside and I put it like a glass on it at night. So really you can use these for so many different things. You could probably use it for your curling iron or straightener as well. So if you don't want to use the chopper, this is definitely another option and it's, it's a little bit prettier and they have a couple of options. Next up, and I don't know why I didn't mention this in the last video, is this paper towel holder. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I don't like the big bulky paper towel holders. I don't like a lot of stuff sitting out. And so this is perfect size for me. I'm gonna go get the one that I have. I love how little and compact this is. I have it all over my house. We have it upstairs, downstairs. I also keep this in our RV just for a dollar. Like you don't have to go out and spend $10 for a paper towel holder. I got a lot of comments from you guys saying that you love all the food storage at Dollar Tree, just like I do. I love anything by the brand SureFresh. And I feel like every time I go, I find different containers they have. Recently when I went, I found this little Rubbermaid take along and it's the perfect size for sandwiches. I like things that are really short like this because I like you know putting leftovers in them and I think they stack really well in your fridge. Like you can get several of them in there. So this would be great for sandwiches leftovers you could put fruit in there for your kids so many options for these but I tend to gravitate more to these versus like the big bulky ones another one of my favorite kitchen items from Dollar Tree has to be these little guys have you guys I know you've probably picked these up before they come in a 10 pack what we use these for at my house is for sauces anytime we have to go somewhere and I need to pack like a little sauce ranch you know mustard or anything I'll put it in here and then it doesn't you know get all over the container I want I know a lot of people also use these in their craft room I haven't done that with them but I mean you get 10 of these for a dollar that's a great Great deal they're BPA free yes okay so this next item I'm probably most excited about oh by the way this container I don't know if you guys watch my IKEA videos but I picked this up at IKEA for $6.99 I'm in love with this thing I use this to like travel back and forth from my office and it fits a ton of stuff so this is what I have all of these Dollar Tree products and to show you guys I was just tool it around in like, what do they call this? Surface vinyl. You know, the little paper that goes in the drawers. I was in that section looking to see if they had anything new. I found this vinyl in marble. So they now have contact paper. It's not the sticky kind. It's like the rubbery matte kind that we can put in our drawers that is made out of marble. Now, the only bad thing about this is you don't get that much in it. Like really, there's probably enough to do a drawer, maybe two small drawers, really not a ton. But if you have a small project, if you're doing a bathroom, I think it's really great. And now they have marble. I'm excited. Dollar Tree has really been stepping up their game with their little jars. I wouldn't call these mason jars, but you know, just little jars. These things are so cute. Last time I was at Dollar Tree, they had three new containers out. They were a little bit bigger than this. These are little small guys and they have 
it's just like a regular lid for it. I thought these would be perfect for overnight oats because they're kind of that perfect size. They're not like a really big one. And so that's what I'm gonna use mine for. But definitely check out your glass section at Dollar Tree because they always are putting out new containers like this. All right, you guys, next let's talk command hooks. I think Dollar Tree has some great options. I know they're kind of controversial. Some people have said, you know, I've tried the command hooks. They don't work well for me. I'm gonna show you the ones that I really like. These silver ones, I like. Now, you can't put the weight of the world on these command hooks. What I like to use them for are oven mitts. So I'll put an oven mitt on there. I'll like just put it on the inside of a cabinet and then put an oven mitt on there. They work great for dish towels. You know, anything much heavier than that, it's probably not gonna hold on here. But a pack of six, that's a pretty good deal for a dollar. When you consider that a command hook is, you know, you get one for a dollar. Now, Dollar Tree does have actual command brand command hooks if you wanna try those. This one's pretty cool. It's pretty much the same thing as these silver ones. Now, it says it holds up to two pounds. Again, I don't really put anything too heavy on these, but if you're looking for the command brand, you can also get that at Dollar Tree. Now, you guys had some great suggestions for different cleaning products that I could use in my kitchen. And on my last video, I told you how I loved the little yellow scrub buddy. Well, I found another version, and this is a scouring sponge for scrub buddies. And I loved how it was like multifunctional on both sides. And I thought this would be great for cleaning around my kitchen. So I went ahead and grabbed this. I haven't used this one yet, so we'll see. I love that it has a little hook that you can hang it up to dry. So we'll see how this one goes. One of the comments you guys told me was that you love Dollar Tree white plates. And I have to agree with you. They are great. You would not be able to tell that the Dollar Tree plates are from the Dollar Tree. They look like anything you can get anywhere else. But they have a great selection of dinner plates, bowls, and they just look modern. Same thing with glassware. You can get some great options at the Dollar Tree. So you don't really have to spend a lot of money if you need some plates. So you guys also gave me a great suggestion that I used to do a few years ago, but no longer do. And it's such a great tip. And that is using the Dollar Tree placemats underneath your pet bowls. These things are just like a nice, you know, vinyl. They're not too thick. They wipe down really easily. I think the reason I don't use this anymore is because Moose's pet bowl's a little higher up, but it totally can work under any pet bowl. And it just helps to keep all that mess off your floors if your dog or cat is a messy eater these are perfect you can also use these in your fridge so you don't get spills all over your fridge i really like this fun little pattern that i found at dollar tree but typically they have i would say about six different styles at my dollar tree so this next item is one that I don't use frequently, but when you need it, you need it. And that is the lemon squeezers at Dollar Tree. These work just as good as anything you can get at any other retail store. So you definitely need to pick them up at Dollar Tree. I keep mine up like above my microwave. I actually bought a new one to show you guys. I have found that these work really well. So the next item that I love buying at Dollar Tree are their little toothpicks. I love that they come in these little containers. They're so easy to like pull a little toothpick out when you need it. Like I hate having those boxes of toothpicks and then they end up you know, flying out all over your drawer. Like there's nothing worse than that. So these are perfect. You get two for a dollar and they fit nicely in my drawer. Anytime you need a toothpick, like they're just really compact and you can pull it out and it's easy. It seems like I can't go to Dollar Tree without finding some sort of storage container that I loved, but I really wanted to show you guys the containers that I like, especially for my kitchen. So one that I just love, it's just called a fridge storage bin, but I love the size of this. It's got a perfect little lip on the front, so they're easy to pull in and out. I find that I use these for so many different things. These are great in your fridge to store snacks. They also work great in the pantry. I like using them in my craft room as well. I think they're perfect for putting acrylic paints in. Like I find a lot of uses for these storage bins. I just think they're a great size. And a dollar, you can't pass them up. The other thing about them is they look really cute when they're all kind of stacked together because they have this lip. You could always label them as well. So these are definitely on my list of ones you need to grab.
Another great option are these chopping mats. You can use them for so many different things to really cut your vegetables. You could also use them in your fridge to create liners. Even though we've done two of these videos now, I know there's still kitchen items at Dollar Tree that I'm missing. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite kitchen items are because I'm dying to try them out. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. I post two DIYs each week. And if you missed our last video, I'll link it here for you. And I'll talk to you guys in our next one. Bye.